Barber County Sheriff's Office wants to give you a better chance to protect your property and then help them recover it if it's ever stolen. It's a trailer identification program and it is all free to you. 7 News' Christine Scarpelli is live at the Sheriff's Office this morning. And Christine, this is such a great resource for so many people. Definitely, yeah, and it's because the sheriff's office has been seeing a bit of an uptake in these sort of thefts. So you and I were mentioning it. We were kind of able to see it because we get those emails and we get those police reports. But if you're not, the numbers kind of look like this. About January 1st, 2016 to April 1st, 2017, about 350 or so thefts. And we're hearing that from, from the source here, Sergeant Wilkie, this morning, telling me just a little bit about what you guys see. Um, it's important first to maybe try to do everything you can to protect your trailer, right? Right. You want to give us just a couple of things to, to touch on? Sure. The biggest thing, uh, probably trailer locks, you can pick those up at a Lowe's, Home Depot, anything mm -hmm. of that nature. Uh, chaining it to a fixture on your property that that's not going to, you know, the easiest way to put it is just make it hard to steal. You know, make it hard for somebody to steal. Suspects are lazy. They're looking for that, that easy out. So Absolutely. And maybe something you wouldn't typically think of. You know, I had to, to listen to you give me a couple of pointers before it clicked in with me. Now, um, if it is stolen, of course, that's very unfortunate. But detectives, these guys do find these trailers. But then it can be be difficult to match the trailer with the person that lost it. So that VIN number is important. Why? Most importantly, we're able to, uh, we get out with trailers from time to time and, and it's hard to prove a trailer is stolen if we can't match it to the owner because we don't know the VIN number. So what we're trying to do with this program is just create a database of VIN numbers of trailers and also provide a secondary number to increase our chances of uh, replacing somebody's property back with them once it's taken. Very good. This is the only county here in the upstate and in the area doing this. So this is great. This uh, Equipment was donated by? That's correct. The National Insurance Crime Bureau. Um, they donated the equipment. Without them, none of this would be possible. Very good. All right. You're just going to have to pull up on Saturday. They're going to be able to take some information from you and again create one of these numbers. It's pretty easy to do. We've been watching it happen all morning. Stay with us. We're going to show you again uh, kind of the process of that happening so you can see it before it's done. But this is what you've got to remember on Saturday, 8 a.m. to 3. 8 a.m. to 3, Saturday, August 19th. Come here, bring your trailer. No questions asked. They'll do any trailer. So there you go, guys. Good stuff. Thank you, Christine.